Hi, this is Dan. Welcome to part two of my uh, Duskers Week 35 challenge run. Um, yeah, now that we have sh um, a long-range scanner, I, um, I took a look-see around at the various systems and um, scattered here and there throughout. Um, I found I think three or four different military outposts, which means you need a military ship to visit them. We don't have one. And the only military ships on the map, it appears, are this one, a military B, which is less than ideal. And was it over here? Yeah. The Ake Ake, which is also military B and less than ideal. So, the trick is going to be, well, there's, there's a number of tricks with a system like this. There's a fair number of outposts scattered throughout, so we need to find a transporter. Um, ideally, we also need to find a ship surveyor, and we need to find teleport drone upgrade. Um, and ideally, we have a ship that has enough slots that we can run them all at the same time. We haven't found a transporter yet. We've checked every place we can check in the sentry system. And in the starting system, we have checked every place we could check, except uh, that was the jump gate. It is already bugged out, and it is revealing itself as a Mohawk infestation type zero craft. It was called the Mohawk before, but it was a jump gate. It still is. And the Batrachian salvage B. Don't think we're gonna. I don't think we're gonna go there right now. I think. <sighs> Only has a scrap capacity of thirty-two. But I think I think we need to jump here first. Jump to the store, and then if we can get to uh, these two ships P and N down in the down in the lower left there and before we do that um, pains me a little bit but um, until we have something like a uh, a scanner probe, which we haven't found yet. Interface really is our good friend. It'll pay for itself sooner or later, I hope. Um, yeah. And Rick, we are gonna scrap you, Rick. Sorry about that. Not really. Sort of sorry, not sorry. Um, ship upgrades. Kind of want to repair this. This has been helpful so far. And then we've reduced our, our level of scrap that we're carrying just in case. Um, just in case we wind up commandeering the Yamaneyame. And let's just go and visit this and see what we've got. Probably won't be a big ship, and it'll probably have defenses. So I don't think we're going to run out of lures here. Um, yeah. So let's board. Let's do it. Yeah. 
Yep, fine with that. Got some scrap. We know where the fuel is. That's nice. Okay, this is a hopeful sign. Cannon and a reroute power. That's a less hopeful sign. We also don't know how many infestation types. Given the ship age, it's probably one or two. It's also a very big ship, I have to say. So, all right. have the remote power installed. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, well... Slime does not spawn. So we have two infestation types, and really? No way to do this, is there? Motherfucker. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Now the clock is ticking now, so. Hopefully this powers enough of the rest of the ship that it does us some good.
come on. I know there's a leaper. Well, actually, I don't know that there's a leaper in there, too, so... now so Wildly inefficient here, aren't I? Yes, I am. Ten, four, and two, that's bad. Okay. Fuck it, let's do it. Who? And we didn't get to pick up that scrap from the sentry we murdered, but, um... Okay... And we have a fucking cannon. Lovely. Well... We have a teleport. We have a stealth. We have a trap that's in better repair than our trap. And we don't have a transporter. And we have a lure that's breaking down rather rapidly. Okay. Okay. It's what we've got. It is what we have. <sighs> Thank you. 
and we have a sensor. So we're, we're gathering slowly all of the tools that we might need. Oh, and this is bugged. One infestation type and it's bugged. Lovely. Well. And Jill, I think you're the only one who's going to play on this ship. Interesting, the interface works in this mode even when it's bugged, but um, it doesn't give you any options, so essentially it doesn't work. Mildly frustrating. Should have brought Corian to use mines. That was just idiotic. Enormous piles of dead swarm. Yeah, 
add all that for one propulsion fuel. myself about that performance, must say. And the tow broke. Decided to tow my own damned run out of there. Right. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do now. So let me step away and think about it. I will be right back. Okay, I am back, and I have had a little bit of a think about this, and it seems to me we have well, we have three choices. Uh, choice one, we could build ourselves a new tow, burn those last two propulsion fuel, and take a run at the netted pug. Though I see now that the netted pug has three infestation types, so that's kind of unspeakably nasty. And my, dr my drones are not in the best shape at present. But that's, I mean, that's choice one. Choice two might be to um, jump back to the Optimist system. Oh, I was thinking we were going to jump back to the store, because the store has a tow. I'm pretty sure the store has a tow. And um, grab the tow, and then go and visit, not the Mohawk, but the Batrachian and uh, see what kind of swag it has. But mainly we'd be jumping back to get the tow, but um, I think that's probably right out as well. <sighs> Suppose we could go and fart around here. I don't think so at this point though. Coral is chock full of gas stations, essentially. Got a fuel depot B, got a space station B, got a space station A, okay. Fuel depot and fuel depot. <sighs> if we jump here and start clearing this out, um, we get we get a bunch more fuel from the coral system. And that uh, That'll give us a lot more flexibility going forward as we as we comb the galaxy trying to find a damn transporter upgrade. And if we start at the shop, maybe we find a tow, maybe we find a transporter there. That would be great. It's also, I think, safest. Um, because this infestation type one, I mean that one has two, that one has one, that one is unknown, but all of these are one or two, so yeah, I think I think this is what we are going to do. more 
intact stealth anyway. We have a lure that is loaded up and is also more intact. So that's good. <sighs> we have more intact rip power, but um, not what we were looking for. Okay. And our choices here are one of the two space stations. Though, before we do that, let us also not forget to sell off the broken toe. Anything else we want to sell off? Might as well sell both of the speed boosts. Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. That gives us a lot more scrap to uh, fix up our drones a little bit. I think... Well, the first thing we do is we create the new tow upgrade. We're going to have to do something like that sooner or later. I don't like doing it this early, really, but, um... And Matt... Do we repair you up to full, or do we repair Jill up to full? I mean, really, we probably repair Matt up to full, but I have a fondness for Jill. And... Be sensible here. Let us not get bogged down by sentimental impulses. And we still don't have a scanner probe, which is disappointing. So, drone config. Okay, and Matt, you will get the stealth, you will get the gather, and what else? What else are we going to give you? Maybe we get the teleport working. Maybe we get the teleport working now. Yeah. I mean, we've got it. It can't hurt to use it. Right. Okay, so it teleport sensor trap. We're going to give you the, not the lure. Oh, an interface. And we have r remote power. Either going to be remote power or rewrap power, but, um, yeah. And hopefully we get enough fuel out of this little jaunt to make it worthwhile. It's kind of a small space station A, isn't it?
Nobody here. Nobody, nobody, nobody here. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, and so it's only leapers. We can work with that. Oh crap. Crap, crap, crap. Okay, so we found three of them. I'm glad we have that teleport. Pretty sure I saw an interface over there that I believe is powered. Because of course they're not. Okay. It's a very long hallway. Right. <laughs> Not generator interface. And no power defense turrets found in those rooms either. Terrific. This is a giant room that apparently has nothing in it. Nothing whatsoever.
their generator in there. I made it a uh, an alias that does a teleport, then a scan, then a stealth. Um, and it's A A. We can't scan anything, so it doesn't really matter all that much, but. Um, Right. Okay, there's nothing in here. Okay, so we've checked all of the rooms. So what are we going to do about R7? Well, Dock A1, first of all. Get that leaper out of there and see what that damn, um, what that damn generator does. Oh, we could have done that already with, no, we did that already, right. Just gonna move all of you little bastards somewhere else. not mind a probe right now. Yep, thank you.
or 10 or 11 or 12. Great. What's going on with the asteroids? What's going on with the asteroids? to assume the asteroids just didn't hit, right? Did it tell us that? Oh, that's that's 5 minutes 13 seconds, so, okay. Um, see if there's a generator in R10. No, there's not. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. So how are we going to do this? So it's behind R14. The generator that controls all the stuff that I think we want to have controlled. Okay, remote R13 then, and remote R7. Did we? No. I don't remember if we had a ship scan on any of these interfaces, but it doesn't matter because we have a probe now. So... R10. Okay. 
Okay. There's nothing in those rooms, because of course there's not. Was I just wrong that there was an infestation in here still? It's entirely possible. Might be the one I moved into R6. We haven't checked. Don't do that. 
don't teleport into the boarding craft with the leaper, that would be bad. It's incredibly shitty that there is one internal generator that, um, by internal I mean not exposed to an airlock. That controls all of the interior rooms, including the only one on the entire station that has a, uh, that has a defense turret in it. That's just lame. Anyway, um, that took a long time, didn't it? Yes, it did. Okay, well, we got one propulsion fuel, which was not as much as we would have liked for our trip to the gas station system. Um, okay, we're going to go to a fuel depot C next, and we're going to call it a part uh, because it's gotten a little bit long especially with the little breather I took to think things through. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time as we plug away, trying to get some more fuel so we can go and do the rest of our business. Yeah. So, see you next time. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks, and bye.